Please welcome your next comedian, number eight, David Evans. Hello, Doyle's town. That's me, number eight. How's everybody doing? Yeah, okay. All right, a little bit about me, because I know you've been wondering all night. In real life, ladies and gentlemen, I am an accountant. Thank you. Any other accountants in the room? Afraid to admit it, huh? I know, I know. It's rough. This was a rough tax season. I got sick, actually. My friend came over. He said, you know, you don't look good. You should get yourself a life coach. I said, a life coach? I don't even know what a life coach is. He said, that's someone you give money to, and they tell you what to do. I said, I already have a wife. I don't need another one. I'm not a Mormon. I'm Jewish. I know, it's hard to believe, right? A Jewish accountant? From Cherry Hill, New Jersey. No, no. Ah, yeah. That's my wife. But by the way, you guys like the jacket? Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for validating me, because my wife hates it. She won't go with me whenever I wear it. So I wear it all the time. It gets a little uncomfortable in bed, I have to tell you. But a man's got to do what a man's got to do, am I right? I kid around. My wife and I, we, we, we get along very well. We recently celebrated our 28th wedding anniversary. 28 years, thank you. Yes. In a row. Consecutively. Day after friggin' day. So what we did, uh, we celebrated. We went out, we, we, we actually adopted a little girl. That's right, we bought a human being. Well, they have to like that, right? Yeah. Right, on Amazon. I'll do the funny shit. You just sit there. Guys, <laughs> trying to get up on stage here. It's filled. There's ten slots and they're filled. But I'm going to use that. Thank you. Thanks for that. Oh, man. I'll tell you what. So she's a good little girl, though. She's from Camden. She's a little foreign girl. She's white, so she's far, no matter where she goes. Actually, what happened is we were, we were, take a step back, we were foster parents. So when a Jewish wife comes up to you and asks you if you want to become a foster parent, she just comes up to you and says, by the way, we're foster parents. <laughs> so why? Why do you want to do this? She said she wants to give back. I said, give back? We have three other kids at home. Can we give them back? <laughs> They're on my nerves. Took my balls from me 28 years ago. I haven't seen them since. Why don't you give them back? <laughs> but no, I finally agreed because she promised me we would get a Mexican kid. My one needs a lot of work. So, uh, <laughs> is, that, is that wrong? <laughs> Can I say that? Trump won. I figured I could say that. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> She is, she is a good kid, though. She's a little, she, she, she's, she's only seven, right? And she loves the Disney movies. But see, we were watching the other day, we were watching The Jungle Book. You guys remember The Jungle Book? See, that's my favorite one. But see, she's too young to realize how unrealistic it is. And I don't mean unrealistic because the animals are singing and dancing, you know? I mean unrealistic because they're wandering through a jungle in India two, for two days. Two days in India, not one liquor store, okay? No 7-Elevens, no Dunkin' Donuts. That's, that's what's unrealistic. Right. Dunkin' Donuts, by the way. You guys like Dunkin' Donuts? Uh, I, I don't like it, I'll tell you. Uh, you know, I don't like it because they never get your order ready. You notice that? I go in there, I order coffee black with sugar. Right? I take it out to the car, figure I better flip the lid. I take the lid off, it's got cream in it. I take it back inside, I say, you young lady, I ordered this black, you put cream in it. You know what she says to me? Did you get that here? <laughs> if I had a cup, it would say Dunkin' Donuts on the cup. I say to her, no. What I do is I carry about a gross of styrofoam Dunkin' Donuts cups in my car. And I go over to Wawa. 
I get coffee with cream at Wawa. Take it out to the car. Pour it in a Dunkin' Donuts cup. Bring it back here to you and try to trade it in. But you caught me. She said, I knew it. I'm Dave Evans, everybody. You've been a great job. Thanks very much. David Evans. Very good, ladies. Okay, so there's two.